Hey guys, it's Will here, and today I'm going to be basically showing you how to use an old iPod in 2023. So it's actually pretty easy. Um, you just use, you, you, it's not, not that di different from how it was when these iPods were new. Pretty much you can, um, all you gotta do is like, say you just find yours in an old drawer, you gotta find your old charger because they do not take the lightning port like newer Apple products. Um, so you just want to um, plug it up and then plug the charger into the wall. And also this little switch up here, as you can see, if it's red, that means it's on hold. So as you can see, nothing will work. But as soon as you unlock it just by sliding, everything is unlocked and usable. So another very simple part of using this is just plugging in headphones. You can really use anything with a 3.5 millimeter headphone jack. You just put it right in the slot down there and you can listen to music through any headphones that you have. So if you're watching this video, um, I'm sure you had an iPod in the past when they were new, or you're just now getting one and you wanna experience them for the first time, kinda like me. Um, I wasn't around when these were like brand new, but they're really just fascinating. It's just, there's so many di different ones. There's anything from these ones, which th this is a nano second gen that I got off of eBay for like $5. But they also had the big iPod classics. Which, if you're, if you have a lot of music that you listen to, I would rec recommend it to get one of those if you don't, don't already have an iPod. Um, because they have just a lot more storage. But yeah, that's pretty much it. It's very simple to use one of these. So that's pretty much it for this video. So hope y'all enjoyed. If you did, please smash that like button. And if you are a new subscriber, I'll see you next time. Bye.